following women's match is set for one fall. One fall. Better than ten. With a ten minute time limit. Introducing first, weighing 150 pounds from Austin, Texas. She is the last pure athlete, Jordan Grace. Broadcast partner Caroline and Jim back here. Looks like uh, Jay George kind of took your spot there for a minute. That's okay. I like Jay George. He's a great I guy. also like the last pure athlete, Jordan Grace. Jordan Grace is an absolutely incredible specimen right here. Did you know that she made her professional wrestling debut at the age of 14, James? Down south, the athletic commission's a little uh, lax, let's say. So you can start at a young age. Just ask Terry Gordy if he was still alive. There you go. And this one is up and running. Deanna Prazo, as mentioned earlier, uh, perhaps the only wrestler, male or female, to compete for the WWE Ring of Honor and TNA within one month. Not only has she done that once, but she's done it twice. Deanna, probably the top women's free agent out there. It's all a matter of time as to see which organization will sign her. This audience here seems to be fluent in Perrazzo. Let's see how this match unfolds. Deanna Perrazzo, the incredible ring presence, takes Jordan down onto the mat. Just Last pure athlete showing the fans how strong she is and what great what great shape she is in. Now Deanna Prazo showing a little something herself. I think Jordan Grace did it better. <laughs> Just my opinion. Jim, are you are you biased in this match? I have to say, uh, both women look to be in exceptional shape here. About to tie up. You have to assume that Jordan is going to have the advantage in terms of power. And there it is. Down to the mat. A quick one count. Deanna Perrazzo with the leg scissors. Giving Jordan a taste of her own medicine. A there. little insult to injury. Jordan is taking a moment to recuperate on the outside of the squared circle, walking around, taking a seat at ringside next to a couple of young fans. Jordan making sure she stays hydrated in this match, drinking some water. Is that the Prince of Aesthetics, Damian Gibbs, sitting there? I figured I should bring it up since you guys are going to see it on camera. <laughs> Okay. 
Is, do you think Sean Donovan does not think that's Damian Gibbs because uh, if I, I'm pretty sure Sean still has a uh, a score to settle with Gibbs. So if that was Damian Gibbs, I don't think Sean would still be sitting here next to me. Pretty sure it's a parasol, not an umbrella, Sean. But you know, same thing. Okay. It has been an incredible night here in Belvedere, New Jersey. August Mania 4 final confrontation. This is not the first confrontation for these women, probably not the last, but let's see what we see. Deanna Praz. We've made it to four confrontations already, so. Many confrontations this evening. Jordan Grace showing that power. What was that, Sean Donovan? Incredible pair of boots. She has an. You're right. She does. Uh, you're right. Showing some Referee. shades of Reggie Bennett in there with that power. It's heating up, and it's not just because it's so humid outside. Big elbow knocking Deanna down, taking her off her vertical base. Again, showing that power. Just wrenching down. And for you folks that might not know, that is where all the organs are located right there. And she is just wrenching down on the liver, on the kidney, on everything inside of Deanna Perrazzo. Hopefully she can, but Deanna fights out once more. Scoop slam, sidewalk slam. Deanna has looked great here tonight, but this match has been all Jordan Grace. You probably like that, huh? And you're surprised with that. I'm not saying I'm surprised. I'm saying I expected this to be a little bit more even, but Jordan is, is tearing Deanna apart. Once again, Jordan has been wrestling for the better part of six years. Made her debut at the age of 14. Originally from Carson City, Nevada the capital of the Silver State, and now Deanna back on the offensive. Just a two count right there. Jordan blocking that suplex attempt. Ah, oh, nice suplex of her own. Takes over Deanna. Jordan Grace back on the advantage. Going for a lot of submission holds is Jordan. Obviously, that's her forte. But at this point, Deanna seems to have her number. I would suggest a different course of action at this point. Roll up, one, two, three! Gargamel, you're just 
distracting the fans from the match. Gargamel, you're a heat steal. Go sit down. 